Well, hey guys, I think I've got this 351 a little better. Um, <laughs> so it may be right, it may be in the carburetor. I fooled with a little bit of that flange. It helped it for about five minutes and then the problem came back, I think. When I sprayed it down for an air leak, I'm thinking it may have just set by the throttle shaft or something. Um, it's in that same area, but uh, it's all kind of a nightmare. I don't think it's crank seals. It may be my next resort, but if I update the carb, I'm just going to go to a 357 carb boot flange and everything on it. It's going to cost a little bit of money, but uh, this thing's kind of driving me crazy. Uh, I'm pretty sure when I run up here in the same piece of wood and time it, um, I about know it's stock 357 by now. You should have seen the video on it. It kind of handed its ass. I don't know yet for sure, but I'm pretty sure that maybe even the Mac 1010, the ported one, that saw's not turned up real hot. But it is, that one was running a big 3.8s, but um, we'll see. What I may do is run this, and I about bet it's still lean when it comes out of the cut. Um, it's going lean about, I don't know, two-thirds of the way in. I can tell I lose power. Uh, just kind of weird. Um, sometimes they can drive you crazy, but we'll run it here. And I think I'm going to go grab my 340, 346 build and see how it does on the same piece of wood. <laughs> if it ain't a meter and lever issue or something. I checked the screen in the car, but it was fine. I should have checked the lever position while I had it apart, I guess. But, um, I don't know. I'm going to pause you guys and run and grab that other saw and we'll compare them. Alright, guys. We've got the 340 build. Three Warhawk cylinder. Um, those of you that ain't seen it, I've bought this saw and the, sprout, the pulley and the OEM cover was busted. I can't find one to fit it. They all have the same pulley as this uh, um, aftermarket cover, just like a 350 has, but I don't know. Um, <laughs> one of these days we'll eventually find one uh, and get the original cover back on it. But I'm gonna see if I can get this warmed up. It's been started in weeks. There you go, Doug, Hillbilly compression test. That's power head bar and all. Shit, she won't start. Must have been bone dry of everything.
think it's stronger than the other saw. Uh, <laughs> I would have more compression and the band on that one, I don't remember or not if I cut it. It's been a little while. Um, I did deck a bunch of material off of that uh, bearing riser a lot. It was a farmer tech one. <laughs> I don't remember what, but I cut a lot off of it. Um, seemed like I did have to do something to get that cylinder to fit. I don't really remember what it was, but she is making more compression than that other saw. I can just tell by the rope test there. Um, and that one had the band in base cut, but it's not broke in either. Uh, I don't know. I've done been told by more than a couple of people that are one of them very knowledgeable in these saws that it was the carburetor on that 351. I was kind of hoping it was. I'd sprayed some carb clean down and around, like I said, the back shaft of that carburetor, and it. You know, I assumed that flange was leaking, but. Whatever it is, what it is, I even glued it when I put it back together. So, uh, it's more than likely the carburetor. Um, if I take one of these saws to saw for this, uh, it'd probably be that one. We done booked our hotel room. Um, hopefully they're not, hopefully bad weather don't set in or anything, but it's turned fall here. It's been in the seventies all day, really nice. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to be let down if I get in there and time these and that old Mac 1010 whipped up on both of them, but it is pulling big chain. These are small chains, so I don't know. A controversy on that which cuts faster or not but uh, a ported 1010 ain't no joke either they're no slouch if you get them dialed in right a lot of you know that anyway um, ain't much stock but they do pretty good ported and turned up a little but anyway thought i'd shoot you guys a quick little video um, show you what i've been into y'all have a good one <laughs>